At 11, there is relief tonight in the Kempsville area of Virginia Beach. That's because police arrested a woman they say was stealing from mailboxes. 37-year-old Suzanne Biles is charged with forgery and identity theft. Ten of your side has been following the story all week. Jason Marks joins us now with the new developments. Jason? Nicole, we first told you about the stolen mail Wednesday night. Since then, several more victims called police saying they too were ripped off. The Kempsville area. Fairfield is on the news. <laughs> the sound of celebration. I survived one. <laughs> the sound that was hard to come by for the last couple weeks. I feel relief. I, I think that's probably be the main thing. It's just relief that you feel a little safer tonight knowing that this person has been apprehended. Thursday night, Virginia Beach police arrested a woman they say was stealing mail out of mailboxes to find personal checks that she could cash. It was my hard-earned money that I worked for to pay my bills, and I was out that money, and, and I'm sure a lot of other people were too. Barbara Creekmore was one of more than a dozen victims who reported the crime. No, I really, I cannot forgive her. I think uh, she needs to think long and hard about what she did. And to make matters worse. You just kept your eye off and the officer a couple times. The suspect lives in the same neighborhood. You'd see her walking by pretty quickly, always on the phone, good stiff pace, walking back and forth in the neighborhood, which is kind of odd and unusual. One resident even confronted 37-year-old Suzanne Biles and snapped this photo. Police won't say how they connected her to the crimes, but they do believe there could be many unsuspecting victims still out there. She touched my money. <laughs> Don't touch my money or my kid. <laughs> so the laughter in the neighborhood is back. You can't get me. They just hope the same can't be said anytime soon for Biles. You did it. And you did it for a while, so you think about it for a while. And you suffer the consequences that are going to be dealt to you. According to court records, Biles has a history of theft and fraud. She did decline my request. For a jailhouse interview. In the meantime, police say if you live in Kempsville, go back and check your bank accounts to see if you too are a victim. And if you are, give them a call. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.